Joining me here on the Mercedes-Benz Vans phone line is a man who returns for the second year of the NFL X Darius Rucker collection by Fanatics. A tremendous response from fans in 2021. You can shop the new line now at fanatics.com and nflshop.com. Also, his latest release, Same Beer, Different Problem, is available right now. Calling in from Cloud9 is diehard Miami Dolphin fan and Grammy Award winner Darius, Darius Rucker. How you been, Darius? I'm good, Rich. How you doing? Am you're I, absolutely right. Am I correct? Is that where you're calling in from, Cloud9? Darius, is that correct? Cloud, I'm right now on Cloud9, yes, after yesterday. What the hell? What the hell? I, I couldn't believe it. Don't get me wrong. I am that stupid fan who, like, when, when Lamar took it to the house, yes. I'm that stupid fan going, okay, man, if we can just score and get a stop and score. But I really didn't expect him to go off like that. That was awesome. I mean, you know, for a franchise that's waiting for the next Marino, and again, I, I we, we need to – we need to see if Tua can be that guy long term. He did something Marino hasn't done since, uh, or any Dolphin hasn't done since Marino in '86, and that's six touchdown passes. What's your two cents on uh, on Tua, Darius Rucker? I like him. I like Tua. I, I, I you know, I was waiting to see if he could get some weapons around him and get some offensive linemen, and we kind of did that this year. And then, uh, you know, I love McDaniel, and I love what he's doing. I love his play calling. So uh, I like Tua. I, I mean. He, he won in Alabama. I don't see why, you know, he's a, I think he's a really great player. And, and you know, I, I, he's got his weapons now. He's, you know, we got a semblance of an offensive line. So, all right, let's, he's got to prove it now. I, mean, I believe in him. Hale and Waddle. I mean, that was unbelievable. I've never seen anything quite like that. Um, and, and Okay, can I ask you a question, Rich? Yes, Darius Rucker. What were they thinking when they're down, when they're up two, and they just let Tyree Kill run by them? Uh, I'm sure John Harbaugh I mean, is saying the same thing right now. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But here's the thing. Here's the thing is that, is that you know, when you're that good, um, as John Harbaugh's Ravens have been consistently, and you believe in your guys, and you know it's coming and you can't stop it, I, I didn't think that the Dolphins offense could be that type of offense where you know well, it's coming either. and you can't stop it. And now they are. I, I I agree. I, I didn't think, you know, since Marina, we haven't had anything like that. And we everybody knew what was coming. And even the, the Waddle touchdown at the end, you know what's coming. There's <laughs> nothing they could do about it. And it was great to watch. You, you know, I got a call from uh, uh, Commissioner uh, Goodell today asking oh. my ring size, my Super Bowl ring. You know, so there's that. <laughs> well, uh, look at you, oh. Darius. You went up straight the flow chart on me. Uh, what, what do you mean? Uh, what do you – you got a I'll call do, from, from, from RG no, – I, I refer – R, RG1 is the way I refer to him. You know, he's RG1. You, know, you guys are tight. Yeah, you guys are tight. <laughs> yeah, what's your ring size? That is funny. How are you a Dolphins fan, Darius? Oh, uh, man, I was five years old, and uh, the Dolphins were playing the Cowboys in, the, in, that, in that Super Bowl, the 72 Super Bowl, 71 year. And I was five years old. I still remember this so vividly. That, uh, and I went around, and my whole family was there, and I went around and asked everybody who they were, who they were rooting for, and everybody said the Cowboys. Because I decided I was rooting for the Dolphins. And uh, they lost, and I cried like a little baby. And uh, but then the next year, I played, started playing Pop Warner, and they went undefeated. So that was that was even <laughs> like a year. Huh? And then you've stuck with them, huh? Thick and thick and thin. You All never thought years. you never thought of hopping off ever. Never. Oh goodness, no! I got the emblem tattoos on my body. I'm a dolphin through and through. Do, you, do I need to ask where that uh, tattoo resides, Darius? Uh, it's it's. It's, it's where it should, like, it's all about hip. Who, what dude gets a tattoo on his hip? <laughs> <laughs> I guess you. I guess you. Is there a story behind that? Is there a story? You know, no, no, this is like 35 years ago, man. I've had this one a long time. Okay, is that, is, is that where same beer, different problem came from? Is that what it's about? Exactly. <laughs> exactly. So, exactly. wow. I mean, again, that was truly unbelievable. Um, so to watch it and see what Tyreek Hill wanted to come and he's there and Waddle was drafted and Tua, you stick through with him, even though the owner was apparently tampering with Brady. And it seems to be... You got the right guy in McDaniel. Have you reached out? Do you know him? In any way, shape, or form connected with the franchise you know, at all? I, I, Dan and I are still real good friends, and so I get to hang out with those guys. And, and we met once, but uh, you know, I'm going to go to a couple games this year and, and, and try to you know hang out and see what's going on because I, you're right. We've, we've really got lightning in a bottle with McDaniel, and, and uh, you know, it's like I said, all I want is one more Super Bowl before I die. Yeah. I don't want too much to ask for. Darius Rucker here on the Rich Eisen Show. All right, brother, uh, tell me about your collection that you've connected with Fanatics, your two. Walk me through that one. 
Oh, man, you know, they, they came and asked me to do it. To do anything with the NFL for me is amazing. You know, you know how big a fan I am of the NFL, Rich. We yes, talked sir. about it before, and, and I live for football. And so the, for me to have a clothing line with the NFL and to be doing it as well, it's really every team has got stuff that's, you know, kind of catered to northern teams, got these great jackets and stuff like that. I mean, you know, it's something for everybody. And, and you know and you know how great Fanatics, their, their clothes, the clothes are so quality. Everything's so quality, and I'm just proud to be a part of it. Mm-hmm. Fanatics.com and NFLshop.com. I see you in your Dolphins gear right now. Do you think you can beat the Bills? Yeah. Do you think you can take the Bills out Absolutely. next week? Or you really do. You really do. We're going 17 and 0, Rich. Uh, <laughs> oh, I didn't know. <laughs> last, last week proved it. We're going 17 and 0. You imagine? It pop, that, now that now that would be a champagne cork popping that uh, that uh, you know the rest of the the remaining Dolphins would uh, not mind. I'm sure. Exactly. 17 and 0. They, they, they'd like that one. All right, and then you can get tickets to your upcoming show dates as well. How are you enjoying being on the road again? We're coming up shortly. I love Derry. it. You know, after COVID, it was so tough. It was something we didn't really, you know, I didn't think that would ever happen, me not being able to play. So now I just love it, man. You made me appreciate it so much more. Yeah, absolutely. You know I mean? Riverfront Revival Festival in North Charleston, South Carolina, your hometown music festival curated and headlined by you, sir. Um, all right, call call back in when you know you got a little bit more time and you're you know you want to crow a little bit more about your dolphins, Darius. Okay, absolutely. I'll call you when we're like five and zero. I'll let you know how great we are. Well, yeah, that'll be. <laughs> if I'm not mistaken, you'll be a third of the way to seventeen and zero. So that'll be great. Thank you very much. Anytime, Thank Darius. You, you take care, brother. That's uh, Darius Rucker right here on the Rich Eisen Show at Darius Rucker on Twitter and Instagram.